The art gallery was alive with the vibrant energy of the Cherry Blossom Festival. Yet, as Iris Bloom stepped inside, a chill ran down her spine. The scent of fresh paint mingled with the sweet aroma of cherry blossoms, creating a deceptive atmosphere of joy. Iris adjusted her sketchbook under her arm, her heart racing as she approached Clara Mirth, the gallery owner. Clara, impeccably dressed in a tailored dress, glanced up from her tablet, her expression a mix of annoyance and curiosity. Iris, maintaining a steady voice despite the tension in the air, asked about Vincent Shade and his relationship with the victim. Clara's eyes narrowed, and she hesitated, revealing a hint of the underlying tension. The detective and Iris sensed a deeper story, especially when Clara mentioned Vincent's jealousy and his experiments with unusual pigments. As Iris left the gallery, the sun dipped low, casting long shadows. The festival's laughter faded into the background, replaced by the weight of hidden truths. Iris had a lead, but the path ahead was fraught with deception. The investigation was just beginning, and Iris was determined to uncover the layers of betrayal that lay beneath the surface. Inside the dimly lit gallery office, the atmosphere was tense as Iris Bloom continued her interrogation. Clara Mirth, the gallery owner, sat across from her, a slight tremor in her voice as she spoke of Vincent Shade. Iris's determination was palpable as she pressed for details about the toxic paint sample found at the studio. Clara hesitated, her eyes darting around the room as if the walls themselves were listening. She spoke of Vincent's jealousy, his feeling of being overshadowed by the victim's talent, and his experiments with unusual pigments. Iris noted every detail, her mind piecing together the puzzle of artist rivalry and hidden truths. The mention of toxic paint was a critical piece of evidence, potentially linking Vincent to the crime. As the interrogation unfolded, Iris's instincts told her that Clara knew more than she was letting on. The detective's mind raced with possibilities, each revelation bringing her closer to the truth. The investigation was gaining momentum, and Iris was determined to follow every lead, no matter where it might take her. As Iris Bloom stepped out of the gallery, the setting sun cast long shadows across the pavement. The vibrant energy of the Cherry Blossom Festival was still palpable, but the laughter and joy seemed distant, overshadowed by the weight of hidden truths. Iris paused for a moment, her mind racing with the revelations from her conversation with Clara Mirth. The toxic paint sample, Vincent Shade's jealousy, and the artist rivalry all pointed to a deeper, more sinister narrative. Iris's resolve was unwavering as she contemplated the path ahead. The investigation was fraught with deception, each layer more complex than the last. Yet, Iris was determined to uncover the betrayal that lay beneath the surface. Her instincts as a detective guided her, each clue and piece of evidence bringing her closer to the truth. The festival continued around her, but Iris's focus was singular. The case was far from over, and she was ready to follow every lead, no matter where it might take her. The investigation was just beginning, and Iris was prepared for the challenges that lay ahead.